Hey everyone, I'm Dorothy with crazyforcrust.com and welcome back to my kitchen. Today I'm gonna to show you how to make one of my favorite no-bake pies. It's a peanut butter pie. It has a peanut butter crust, a peanut butter filling, and a nice, delicious Cool Whip topping. You're not gonna to wanna to miss this recipe. Calling all peanut butter lovers, this recipe is for you. It is a rich, sweet, delicious peanut butter pie that's completely no bake. It's gonna be your favorite pie all year long, but especially in the summer when it's too hot to turn on your oven. For more delicious desserts and easy recipes, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Now let's get in the kitchen. To start your peanut butter crust, we're gonna use peanut butter cookies. I'm using Nutter Butters, but you can use the generic equivalent. Add the cookies to your food processor and pulse until they're a nice fine crumb. Now you could use Oreos for this crust or graham crackers, but I just love the extra peanut butter flavor that using the peanut butter cookies gives. Then you're gonna add your cookie crumbs to five tablespoons of unsalted butter. Stir that together with a fork until it's nice and crumbly. Add your crumbs into your pie plate. This is a nine inch pie plate and use your hands and a glass to press the crumbs into the bottom of the pan and up the sides. You could use a little bit bigger of a pie plate or a deep dish, but don't use anything smaller than a nine inch. Then chill the pie crust while we make the filling. To make the filling, you're gonna use one box of pudding mix. This is instant pudding, a 3.4 ounce box of vanilla. You're gonna add one and a quarter cups of milk. I'm using non-fat, but you can use whole milk also. Whisk that together until the pudding mix is dissolved into the liquid. Let the pudding mixture set, and then you're gonna add three quarters of a cup of peanut butter into the mixture. You can use creamy or crunchy. I'm using a mixer, but you could use your whisk to combine the pudding mix and the peanut butter. Just whisk or mix it until it's nice and smooth and thick and creamy. Once it's nice and mixed, you're gonna add Cool Whip or whip topping. I'm using one eight ounce container of whip topping and I'm gonna add this into my mixture. Now it's really important that you not use the mixer for this and that you fold or carefully stir the peanut butter mixture and the whip topping together so that it doesn't become too runny add the mixture into your pie crust. Smooth it out and then chill it until you're ready to serve. Before serving, I'm gonna top it with more whipped topping and some sprinkling of cookie crumbs. See how easy it is to make this peanut butter pie? It's super sweet and fluffy and that peanut butter flavor is in every bite because of the filling and the crust. If you love peanut butter, this is the pie for you. Leave me a comment and let me know what your favorite peanut butter recipe is. I'm gonna go enjoy some pie while you keep watching. Mm -hmm. 